You know, we like to keep you informed here on Studio 10 of jobs and careers. Maybe you're looking for a new one. So we came to Capital Area Michigan Works. I'm with Nick. And first of all, tell me a little bit about the job fair going on behind us. So this morning's event, we have over 25 employers that are here. There are positions, all of them are $15 an hour and up as far as the starting wage. So from entry level to advanced degrees, we have a little bit of something for everyone. Uh, multiple industries represented. We've got the state of Michigan here with the Department of Corrections and Department of Treasury. Michigan Department of Health and Human Services is here. Sparrow Hospital, uh, Manitou, pontoon boats, uh, a little bit of something for everyone. And I like it because there's over 25 vendors, so like you said, something for everybody. Maybe they're looking for an internship, maybe they're not quite ready to change careers, but they can kind of get their feelers out there and get in front of these employers to kind of let them know, hey, this is who I am and this is what I'm interested in, and then they can keep their resume on file, right? Right, right. Okay, awesome. So talk to me a little bit about who the job fair is for. So the job fair is for Lansing. You know, we try to bring employers in that are easily accessible. You know, most of them are close to the bus line. And again, individuals that may be looking to re-enter the workforce or join the workforce for the first time. You know, that's why we're here today. And Nick, this is one of your first job fairs in a while. And this is kind of nice to have this face-to-face -face interaction because we've kind of been challenged with that for a while, right? No, absolutely. This is the first event that's in person that, that I've been a part of since the pandemic started, at least with Capital Area Michigan Works. And you know, it's it's a breath of fresh air. You know, we're here outside to promote social distancing and safety, and we're able to be here today, and the employers are here and hoping that people make a good impression and build some jobs. Absolutely, and Nick, what makes your job fair unique? I know it's kind of unique, it's kind of different, kind of special. What's unique about this job fair and why people should kind of contact the employers that you guys have out? Well, I think first and foremost is the, the entry wage. Again, $15 an hour, that's the bare minimum in order to participate in this event. So that's something that should provide self-sufficiency, and that's, that's really the goal. Uh, the other unique aspect is the, the the trust that put this event together. You know, the collaboration between Department of Health and Human Services, Lansing Police, Lansing Fire, Capital Area Michigan Works, and and Peckham. You know, all of us together kind of made this happen. Okay, and as you're walking around this morning, kind of talking to people that are here, what's been the energy? What's been the vibe? What has the response been to having this back in person? Yeah, you know, it, it's a nothing but positivity so far. Everybody's kind of excited to to meet face to face. Uh, you know, when it comes to sitting with employers, there's always that traditional method, I guess it's traditional now, of mm -hmm. applying online. And you know, that doesn't make the same kind of impression that you can do here in person. So I think that people are really excited for that. Yes. Now, Nick, if people missed out on this job fair, but they're still interested, they're looking for a new job, they're looking for a career change, how do they get in contact with the folks here? Uh, almost all of the employers, you know, through their website, they're still taking applications. You can read a little bit more about the, the job itself and, and get into those descriptions. but. Okay, and you guys have a list of them on your Facebook website, Capital Area Michigan Works. How do we kind of see the list of rundown of people that were here? Yeah, through the Capital Area Michigan Works Facebook page, there is a flyer for the event and all the employers that are participating in this event, they're listed there, so that'd be the best way. All right, Nick, well, the weather held out for us, so that is the good news, and I'm so excited to see so many people in the tents kind of making those connections. This is a great event. Thank you for having us out today. Oh, thank you for having me. All right, stick around. Studio 10 continues after this.